Yeah, hi there. In these comments, I'm going to just use your nickname. You're using Gil. And in your specific situation, uh, your TOEFL score right now is 80. And you want to get 90. You say in your practice test right now, you've been scoring about 23 on the reading, 22 on the listening, 15 on the speaking, and 20 on the writing. So you'd like to improve your score about... 10 points, right? So uh, I, I think I can do this. I think we can do this. Uh, I'm going to make a recommendation right now. Remember that this is just a recommendation and once you make your payment and become one of my students, you will have complete access, unlimited access, to all 630 of my vocabulary, pronunciation, grammar, reading, listening, writing, and speaking lessons. So you have complete access. Now, from what I can tell based on the information you've given me, you need to improve more in the speaking and the writing areas. That's what I'm seeing here. So uh, I'm going to recommend my 60-day writing and speaking study guide. And that's going to focus more on speaking, pronunciation, writing, and also grammar. <laughs> now, of course... You can study any of the lessons you like, but th this particular study guide is focused on helping you make improvements in the areas that you need the most. So again, I'm going to recommend my 60-day writing and speaking study guide for you, and uh, let me know what you think. All right, anyway, good luck to you. Thank you for um, for your comments, and I know you, you'll be pretty close to your deadline. You're taking the TOEFL. Uh, in April, so obviously you want to do better than what you're doing right now. So you've got about two months to work on improving your academic English. All right, now in addition to using my course, I do have two other suggestions which can be useful. Get in the habit of reading and practicing listening on a regular basis. For reading, read magazines, newspapers, and longer books. Try to read approximately 45 minutes a day. And then for listening, you can listen to news, science, documentary, and history type programs. You can do that. And uh, get in the habit while you do the reading and the listening practice, note take. Focus on the main and the most important supporting points of those reading and listening passages. And then you can work on uh, using those notes to practice either speaking about the information or writing about that information. And guess what? That's going to help you with your integrated speaking and integrated writing areas, which will help your score. So think about those other two suggestions. So if you spend about maybe two hours a day doing that, and maybe one to two hours a day at my online TOEFL course, uh, you will be able to make progress. And hopefully, you'll make the progress you need by the next time you take the TOEFL in April. Now, I can't guarantee any of the results. Most of my students improve approximately 5 to 10 points for each month that they use my course. Of course, your progress determines on how much you're using English, uh, how much you study at my course, and so on. All right, thank you.